boys and girls, my name is Otto Steel and welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. And as you can see, the Iron Volcano is once more not operational. Uh, but this time it's a different issue. You see uh, the uh, steam turbines, uh, they are a bit fickle so while we made them out of steel so that they do not take damage if they are getting too hot in order to operate they have to have a temperature below uh, 100 degrees celsius and as you can see here the hydrogen is above that temperature so that means the, uh, the turbines were not working. I have tried to uh, solve this problem by uh, pumping in a lot of water in here to cool uh, this down but it did help a bit but not that much because uh, having that much water in here means that the steam also cools down and if the steam is below 125 degrees uh, it's no good to the steam engines so yeah that's why i have uh, created this setup uh, up here so we can try to cool down the uh, hydrogen to be around 90, 90 degrees and then we will rebuild the uh, steam turbines so that uh, uh, the machines have a lower uh, starting temperature and then we should see this thing come together. Uh, and while well added, I also replaced the, the wire in here. I um, have also uh, completed all the other wires and even extended the wire up to here where I have been at work uh, on this system. Here the cooling setup looks like we have vacuum in here, previously it was still a bit of uh, hydrogen in here, so we can close that one. We will deconstruct the gas pump, we will let in water, and here I started uh, filling up this tank with uh, polluted water that I get from down here. Over here I have started to lay out a bit of uh, something. I'm thinking maybe here on this side we could create a, a Paku farm. That's however something more for the, for the long run. And here I found uh, a use to do a bit uh, of uh, building in uh, lead because in here it does not really matter. It's, it's cool in here so the overheating temperature is not an issue and uh, we do not have duplicates going in here so the decor does not matter either. So then we need one more of these and as you can see I have already put all the, uh, the piping in place. Um, we need one more sensor there. Um, and then a bit of wiring. Okay. 
How much water do we have here? 33 kilograms. That's that's not enough. Um, then let's see. This one should be minus four. And this one would be 10, and this one 24. All right, we do have a bit of, uh, of iron. So, Actually, I do not need this wire anymore. So we can dispose of that and then have a new conductive wire crossing over here. I don't want to uh, do it uh, too far to the edge here because it has uh, an radiating decor effect, uh, but up to this point it should be or if not good then uh, at least okay. Right, then here to connect this piece up. And then we should be set. Um, what's your problem? Ah, okay. I missed a piece there. That should solve it. How much water do we have here on the floor? Uh, 100 kilograms. A bit more is probably helpful. Then let's check up down here. The hydrogen is getting warmer. That's probably because the steam down here is getting warmer and uh, uh, through here we have a bit of a transfer and this might not be the best setup to do it um, so probably we will only manage to have reasonable cooldown um, once this iron volcano uh, goes dormant again, which will be in uh, certain more cycles. But if we look at the uh, gas pipe that's going in, that's 142, and what's going out, it's uh, 130. So we do have a bit of uh, cooling going on here. 
and probably it's needed otherwise the uh, effect would be uh, even worse so yeah let's take the sand we do have quite a bit um, we can attack the shock walls here there's the third one Well, the uh, calories, they have been a bit shaky as of late. Um, uh, also, uh, a battery power uh, dropped to zero at one point and I'm not really sure why because I did not add that much more power consumers. So it's a bit of a mystery to me. Okay, well then, we will have something like this, yeah, that should do, okay, now I have constructed the pipe here and only this part is missing so once that is built we should see flow the uh, hydrogen from down here here to the top We have quite a bit of steel sitting there, but uh, remember, I have deconstructed the two uh, steam turbines down here, so we have to keep that steel uh, in, in spare so we can build them up again. Um, but I have also continued uh, to build a few more bunker doors here to the side which should help and I think we can now go ahead and do these ones. Um, this water down here will probably not be not enough so I guess we will also uh, dig in to, uh, to this a bit more we also probably have not enough um, not enough um, uh, slime while our um, slime farm now is is actually uh, uh, producing now and again we had we got a few more pufflet eggs so we should see some uh, some slime dropping out of these pufflets and we have a nice polluted oxygen atmosphere in here They have dug out everything here and I do not remember what kind of event uh, this was a minor volcano. After all, we will not um, create a, a Paku farm 
here on this side. Minor volcano could be good, but uh, volcanoes are even more troublesome uh, when it comes to cooling than um, uh, iron volcano. They, on the one side, they are a good source for um, for energy. But we can also get a bit of um, ingenious uh, rock. Is it ingenious rock? Um, ingenious rock, yeah. Out of it, and that we can feed to our hatches. Which would solve some issues. Okay, so now here we are done. Meaning we can deconstruct this part. Um, we can deconstruct this part. If we do not the Peku farm on this side, uh, I guess this means um, we can pump out the water from here. And this will probably take a while. You can mop up here on this side to clean up the thing there. Um, did I miss the wiring here? looking here I still need a bit more water here but on this side the uh, 
hydrogen is in, so that should be good. And we only need to connect our wire. Like this. get here a pufflet but pufflets are difficult to transport as you cannot uh, trap them you have to lure them and that's that's a pain especially if we have to lure them from up here all the way down there so I will forgo that and then let's have a last look in here yeah but at least the uh, the iron uh, uh, solidifies and the steam uh, it's getting hotter so maybe i will break this open once more and put in more water which means uh, the water turns to steam the uh, gas pressure rises above 150 kilograms uh, per tile and then uh, we have over pressure here and the iron volcano will no longer uh, output any iron so I have to pump out uh, steam again but that shall do for this episode hope you enjoyed this a bit of a chaotic one fixing here and there and we will continue with that in the next one see you